Hey guys, what's going on? It's Mike835 again, bringing you another G-Shock review and unboxing. And today I have something for you very special, as you see here with the black box with the 30th anniversary, of course, designed by master artist Eric Hayes. Of course, as you see here, 30th anniversary, G-Shock. It's a pretty big box. I'm not going to show you the model number just yet, but um, I received this over the weekend, so I figured it was a good time to do a video and review and unboxing for you guys today so um, before I start I want to say um, for me to obtain this wasn't easy I had to um, definitely save up a few pennies and um, I guess it shows my dedication to the brand and um, without further ado let's just open pop a top like my gate 35 can and see what we have here and we have the tourist warranty card from Casio right there. We also have Japanese mo uh, manual, module, <laughs> manual. So yeah, um, I have to look for the instructions online how to set this watch, which is pretty easy, which I, I, um, I have um, messed around with another model like this uh, in the past, uh, like at the store, just trying it out and stuff like that. So, um, but yeah. I held out for this one for specific reasons because this is a 30th anniversary piece. Um, I was going to get another version, which is the same watch, just it's not the same, uh, same model, uh, but not the same uh, watch that I'm going to show you today. Of course, you see here the 5311 module, and if you see here, beautiful trunk box inside. And if you're wondering what's inside, let's just flip it over and see what we have for you guys today. Let me put this off to the side. We've got to start in. Of course, you see here a beautiful black tin can. Not tin can, I'm sorry, trunk box. Beautiful trunk box as you're seeing here. Um, so, I love trunk boxes. Get what you pay for definitely with Casio and you know many brands. So um, as you see here, let's take this paper off, see what we have here. As you see here, G-Shock, of course, 30th anniversary piece. I've only seen stock photos of this model, but your boy Mike 835 got it in his hands a little bit early. I'm not even sure if these coming out to the States. Uh, so without further ado, I'd like to give you a glimpse on my new G-Shock Aviator 30th anniversary exact model sky cockpit as you see here on the tags model number GW A 1130-1JR and this retails respectively for 72,000 yen Japan and 75,600 with taxes uh, 72,000 yen equivalents about $720 Definitely a piece that uh, it's not every you know it's not for everybody, and definitely um, you know one of those more expensive Casio G-Shock uh, pieces. Of course, um, that is to expected because this is a Casio Sky Cockpit Aviator, and aviators are expensive. So um, I just wanted to give you a glimpse on this awesome pickup which I made. Um, yeah, like I was saying in the beginning of the video, you know, it's, I know it's not cheap. I know it's pretty expensive, but, uh, in my case, I wanted one of these 1100 aviators after seeing so many, uh, YouTube reviews and, uh, pictures online. I gotta have, you know, had to have one. I was going to go by the, the green version, the green and black. Uh, but, um, you know, I know that there was a 30th anniversary piece coming and I know it was a little bit of more money, but you might as well. Um, I'm not going to say the popular word, but you know, only live once, so um, might as well take advantage while you're here on the, on the planet. So without further ado, let me go around um, on this beautiful watch, show you the, the, a couple details of this watch. Of course, if you guys didn't know, this is a tough solar, also as expected, shock resist, as well as triple G resist. And, uh, of course, 200 meters from Casio, it has a uh, um, auto hand correction, so make sure that those hands are always perfect. Of course, uh, you have a Neo Bright Loom, a beeper alarm, multi-band six, uh, 
it has 29 time zones as you see here on the around the dial it's you know simply amazing piece something that um is, is very beautiful oh yeah as well um as well as has a sapphire crystal as you're seeing here it, when uh, watch has a sapphire crystal it sort of looks like there's no crystal it's very nice um watch in my opinion and um let me uh, zoom in here and um, give you guys a glimpse of this beautiful watch as the light hits it. Um, this watch, you don't really need to do nothing. You just need to watch it and all the movements. If you if you see here on the bottom in the middle, it says the arrows pointing to Monday. And today, of course, here on the right-hand side of the date window is the 18th, November 18, 2013. Your boy Mike get 35 got his mitts, his paws on this big bad, big, big bad boy watch since 1983. You know, I've been around since 1983, so these anniversary pieces are always special. You know, I always get my mitts on them. And um, it's a beautiful watch, as you see here on this part. It says multiband 6, tough solar. It is a big aviator, guys. It's not, it's not for your small wrist. It's definitely, you know, it's a big watch. I really, uh, let me zoom in here. I really like the way that they um, did these buttons here on the side. Um, definitely a really nice uh, texture to them. As you're seeing here, if my camera's, camera would focus, I can show you. It usually does. I'm not sure why it's acting up, but yeah, as you see here on this side. And then you have the buttons which are very easy to press they have that texture um, much like the the new range band so that's really cool in my opinion of course this is a dial let me take off the buckle here show you guys this is a 30th anniversary 30 stars models you're seeing here 30 stars in the buckle super nice uh, classy piece something that you know for more of the G-Shock mature audience, something that uh, you can wear out casually out to the street and uh, when you don't wanna wear something which is like a uh, rainbow color or you know, something like that. Um, this is definitely something that uh, is, just, you know, it's a manly piece. It's not something that um, you can see too many uh, kids wearing around uh, because it's not that type of piece. But it's as you see here, a beautiful back plate course designed by uh, Mr. Eric Hayes of the 30th anniversary logo. The quality of this piece is uh, very high in my opinion um, as well you know as good as a, as a frogman if not even better. The logo is just beautiful. Let me zoom in here give you guys a, some eye candy. I know you guys are enjoying it. Um, I am enjoying also doing the video review and unboxing on this beautiful piece. I see on the top it says multiband 6 and start and stop. And then you have sapphire glass right there. It says it. And um, it's just a very beautiful piece. Very beautiful. It's a large watch, guys. Um, if you're not, you don't have like at least 7, 8 inch wrist, um, it would be a very hard um to uh, actually rock it and put it on or whatever. Um, this feat, this uh, watch that I'm showing you here is very feature packed um, as well as uh, you have a compass button up here. So if you press it, it reads and then depending where you move it, it tells you what direction you're going. Really interesting uh, compass as well as many features that this watch has to uh, offer. A good zoom here. This is the mode button. If you press here, it cycles through the modes. As you see here. Which is the, um, the arrow on the right hand side. It points to in what mode you are, as you're seeing here. World time. And then if you press here, st stopwatch. That's the stopwatch as you're seeing here. Beautiful movement uh, from Casio G-Shock. Definitely very nice. 
in my opinion that is the stopwatch going on this beautiful aviator model as you're seeing there very smooth movements very nice as you're seeing here very nice piece so we just cycle back to um could stop it again then we go to here if we hold it for one second it brings it back to timekeeping mode automatically as you're seeing here beautiful watch it um, adjusts to my time zone which uh, currently is uh, 9.22 so as you see here the perfect time actually you can check if uh, this watch synced up last night by uh, all you have to do is uh, press right here this button on the right bottom and the hands are gonna move see it's gonna go do the whole turn and it's gonna say yes the Y for the yes anyways I'm sorry my phone's going off right now but I wanted to show you uh, this watch on my wrist as you see right here it's really nice size zoom out there this is a uh, the the watch on my wrist, which, you know, it's a nice piece, really nice size, definitely recommended. Uh, to show you the backlight. There's a little bit of light in this room, but let's see. Yeah, which is pretty nice, as you see here. Sky cockpit, G-Shock, um, Aviator from Casio. The first video that I've seen it personally, uh, which I'm making for you today, and um, let alone the. I haven't seen any any stock pictures of this watch, so I went with it um, pretty much uh, on a hunch, and I'm glad I did. It's a beautiful watch, and I um, would love it to add it to my collection. Very uh, nice piece. Um, I don't want to keep rambling and wasting your time today, guys. Uh, so, without further ado, um, uh, you know, let me finish my video. So. Um, Guys, I just wanted to thank you guys again for watching my video. Big shout out to uh, my favorite, favorite, favorite um, new collector, uh, Ben Rosin. Hey, Ben, um, a, mess a message from me. Hey, keep doing what you're doing. Don't uh, listen to people. Do what you like and buy what you like. And um, I know that you're on a pace to uh, take me out, take all the YouTube reviewers out. Um, Cause you're just like a crazy uh, collector, man. Like I can't believe it. you guys gotta check out. Uh, type in uh, Ben Rosin on uh, on YouTube. I believe it's Benjamin Rosin, new collector, uh, young guy. Uh, even picking up vintage pieces. Wow. <laughs> Anyways, Ben, I I really do hope uh, uh, you keep on on YouTube and um, buying the G Shocks, of course. And um, definitely got to watch out for you. You're going to take us all out. <laughs> That's no doubt. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching my video. Um, I really had a good time uh, giving you my review and unboxing on this beautiful 30th anniversary, 30 stars uh, aviator. The exact model again is the GW A1130-1JR. I hope you enjoyed my video. And YouTube, we'll see you later.